In this video, we'll show you how to install the coated outhaw slug. Measure the distance of your slugs or slides along the foot of the sail, how far they project away from the bolt rope. You'll want to try to match that here at the clue when installing the coated outhaw slug. We're using a 3 quarter inch polyester tubular webbing. You can see Deb wrapping it through that cringle at the clue corner. So she wraps it around there double and then she'll use pre-wax twine and a hand needle and stitch a figure eight to secure the outhaul slug to the clue corner. Here she verifies the distance that the slug projects from the foot of the sails boat rope and they're equal with the slug or slide that you would install along your foot. We'll use a wax twine. This is a five ply wax twine and a number 16 hand needle. Penetrate the center of the webbing with the hand needle. Pull the thread through leaving approximately a one inch tail. Come around the webbing from one of the sides, doesn't matter which, and penetrate the center again. Suck the tail under, then wrap the twine around the opposite side. Penetrate the center. You're always working from the top side. We'll do this at least three times around each edge. We're creating a figure eight. So repeat the process about three times on each side of the webbing. We'll speed up the film to save time. Please excuse the plotter vacuum noise in the background. Jeff Frank, our sail designer, is designing sails and plotting them on our 50-foot plotter bed. When that's complete, we'll take our needle and penetrate the previous stitches to bury the twine. Because Deb's not using a palm, she'll have to use needle nose pliers. Pull it right through. Once the twine is tucked between the previous stitches, she'll tie a knot. Then we'll use a hot knife to create a button with the pre-wax twine. If you don't have a professional hot knife, you can use a wood burning tool, a soldering gun, or even a piece of metal that's been heated over a flame. Use caution if you do that. Here we are using the professional hot knife. By touching the pre-wax twine with the hot knife it creates a beautiful button. Just press it with your finger and it will not come out. We're also using the R blade for the angle hot knife. We'll cut off the excess webbing there making a beautiful outhaul slug yeah. at the clue of your mainsail. That's all there is to it. I'm Eric Grant. For all of us here at Sierra, right? Thanks for watching.